Canada Geography and Climate Canada occupies much of the continent of North America, sharing land borders with the contiguous United States to the south, and the U.S. state of Alaska to the northwest. Canada stretches from the Atlantic Ocean in the east to the Pacific Ocean in the west, to the north lies the Arctic Ocean. Greenland is to the northeast and to the southeast Canada shares a maritime boundary with the Republic of France's overseas collectivity of Saint-Pierre and Miquelon, the last vestige of New France. By total area, including its waters, Canada is the second largest country in the world, after Russia. By land area alone, however, Canada ranks fourth, the difference being due to it having the world's largest proportion of freshwater lakes. Of Canada's 13 provinces and territories, only two are landlocked. Alberta and Saskatchewan, while the other 11 all directly border one of three oceans. Canada is home to the world's northernmost settlement, Canadian Forces Station Alert, on the northern tip of Ellesmere Island, latitude 82.5 degrees north, which lies 817 kilometers, 508 miles, from the North Pole. Much of the Canadian Arctic is covered by ice and permafrost. Canada has the longest coastline in the world with a total length of 243,042 kilometers, 151,019 miles. Additionally, its border with the United States is the world's longest land border, stretching 8,891 kilometers, 5,525 miles. Three of Canada's Arctic islands, Baffin Island, Victoria Island, and Ellesmere Island, are among the ten largest in the world. Since the end of the last glacial period, Canada has consisted of eight distinct forest regions, including extensive boreal forest on the Canadian Shield. Canada has over 2 million lakes, 563 greater than 100 square kilometers, 39 square miles which is more than any other country, containing much of the world's fresh water. There are also freshwater glaciers in the Canadian Rockies and the Coast Mountains. Canada is geologically active having many earthquakes and potentially active volcanoes, notably Mount Meagre Massif, Mount Garibaldi, Mount Cayley Massif, and the Mount Edziza Volcanic Complex. The volcanic eruption of the Zexcon in 1775 was among Canada's worst natural disasters, killing an estimated 2,000 Niska people and destroying their village in the Nas River Valley of northern British Columbia. The eruption produced a 22.5 kilometer, 14.0 miles, lava flow, and, according to Niska legend, blocked the flow of the Nas River. Average winter and summer high temperatures across Canada vary from region to region. Winters can be harsh in many parts of the country, particularly in the interior and prairie provinces, which experience a continental climate, where daily average temperatures are near minus 15 degrees Celsius, 5 degrees Fahrenheit, but can drop below minus 40 degrees Celsius, minus 40 degrees Fahrenheit, with severe wind chills. In non-coastal regions, snow can cover the ground for almost six months of the year, while in parts of the north snow can persist year-round. Coastal British Columbia has a temperate climate, with a mild and rainy winter. On the east and west coasts, average high temperatures are generally in the low 20s degree Celsius, 70s degree Fahrenheit, while between the coasts, the average summer high temperature ranges from 25 to 30 degrees Celsius, 77 to 86 degrees Fahrenheit with temperatures in some interior locations occasionally exceeding 40 degrees Celsius, 104 degrees Fahrenheit.